Namaste, welcome to Gita's Kitchen. Today we will see how to make a, another simple yet very very traditional and uh, medicinal value recipe and that is Mor Kolambu. Mor Kolambu also known as Kadi in Hindi. But today we are going to use this Ajwain leaf. Ajwain is carom seeds in English and all of us know carom seeds also known as Bishop's Weed. So I, we are going to use the leaf. leaf. See? See, these are the Ajwain or uh, Omam leaves. Very, very beneficial for health. I also have some beetle leaves, pan leaves, which is just coming up slowly. And some and some curry pata, which is taking some time to come up. I just need two or three leaves. That will do. Here is a close-up view of the leaf. Ajwain leaf, carom seed leaf, also as Omavalli or Karpuravalli. It grows even up to this size. You can see the serrated edges and you can know, recognize it by the feel. It is quite uh, soft and yet a little bit thick to touch. And it has the lovely aroma of Omam or Ajwain. We will need to grind a masala. So for this I am taking three of these leaves and also two green chillies and about one fourth cup of fresh grated coconut and a little water and grind it into a paste now take a tablespoon of rice flour in a bowl add some curd to it I have taken about one cup of curd a pinch of haldi powder add some water and whisk it all together now we will pour this uh, curd mixture into our kalchati also we will add this ground ajwain leaf and coconut green chilli paste I am adding a little more water to this now on a medium flame Allow it to cook till it comes to a boil. See now it is starting to come to a boil. Now I will add some salt to it. Just allow it to cook for a few minutes more. And it is done and ready. It is bubbling well now. You can switch it off. For the tadka or seasoning, I am taking a little bit of coconut oil, add some mustard seeds, some jeera or cumin seeds, one dry red chilli and also one omam leaf, we will just add to this and also a few curry leaves. Pour it on top of the mortar. Our lovely aromatic Omavalli mor kolambu or uh, Ajwain leaf mor kolambu is now ready to be served. You can serve it with some hot rice or if you like to have it with full kas also you can have. Today I have made some sweet potato curry. As I said earlier, all dry sabjis we refer to as curry at home. And it's about some hot rice, a little bit of ghee, and we can have it with this omavalli more corn. For people like us living in apartments. Within the limited space, you can try to have a tulsi, this uh, omam leaf or omavalli, some curry leaf, maybe a little bit of coriander leaf, methi seeds you can plant. This has got a lot of uh, medicinal uh, properties too. Simple home remedies, very often children, adults alike, we suffer from some indigestion, stomach disorders. Generally, we give them omam seeds and some water to drink. Just take one leaf, wash it well 
give it to the person or ask him to chew it you will find very good relief for stomach ailments digestive problems it is also a effective for a bad breath too and of course for curing from colds and coughs and removing the phlegm this is excellent for smaller children you can actually crush the leaves extract the juice and give it to them it will work wonders so try out this omavali morkadu and use this kind of a uh, traditional uh, recipes at least once a week so that you get the wonderful medicinal benefits too thank you for watching the video please subscribe to geetha's kitchen and we'll meet again with another interesting recipe from geetha's kitchen